these pants. There you go. All right, Kaylee, thank you for that. And that right now sets us up perfectly to talk about all of the playoff matchups. Should do that. What do you say we take a little walk? Let's do it. Do it. We're going right. over to the big board where we find NBC there News national political correspondent Steve Kornack in that. his signature khakis. I've never heard of, of the Vaseline trick before. That's yeah, I hadn't either. I don't know. Well, I tried it. I don't recommend it. <laughs> Kick off with Kornack. I like that. So let's. I mean, let's start. Let's go chrono- chronologically here, Steve. Let's start with the Saturday matchups. What are they looking like? Yeah. No big week. Weekend, big long weekend here of football and start on Saturday. We will kick off the weekend with the Browns and Texans. You just heard really interesting matchup there between the rookie quarterback, very yes. possibly the rookie of the year, C.J. Stroud. The Texans had no expectations whatsoever this year. They win the AFC South. They will host the Cleveland Browns with the aging veteran who was out of the game, Black came back. Oh. The Browns have had a quarterback odyssey this year. Four different quarterbacks have won the games. But then, prime time on Peacock, it is. You were just teeing it up. In fact, we've got a special effect. Watch this. Ooh, okay. The ice oh, balls. Funny. Will it even be above zero for That's kickoff insane. at Arrowhead yeah. Stadium? Put this in perspective because we've been talking about this for the past couple of days of how cold it's really going to be. I think people underestimate it, but let's talk about, I guess, in the grand scheme of things, how does it rank? Yeah, so that's it here. Uh, Dolphins.